Welcome back to Kentucky Cooner. This is September the 24th. It's been a little while since you've been out here with me. Ain't been a while. Ready to get out here and put them on the wood? I am. The only dogs we're going to be hunting tonight is May and little Cam. Luke is out of town working, so maybe him and Mac will be on the next one. We've already got them loaded up. We're going to hit the road. we got about an hour and 20 minute drive. Well, we just got here to our first turnout. May, Cam. Little Cam out there. I'll get to tell you. Boy. I definitely think that I might have messed up by putting a hoodie on, but it said it's going to get down 40 some degrees. Maybe a long sleeve shirt would have done good in the beginning and this hoodie at the end. We normally don't ever have a chance to get a break following behind these hounds. They get treated quick. I think that's it, buddy. We turned the camera on to let you all know that she struck in. What was it? Uh, 259? Yeah. She dislocated when we turned the camera on to tell you what was going on. Cam's in there with her. Let's get in there, buddy. Well, you can't ask for no better than that. Dog getting there, get struck fast, get treed fast. Just that many more drops we can make tonight. We're going to get in here and try to show you guys this coon. Good girl, man. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Can't even get to the tree. Good girl. What do you think about it, Cam? What a mess. Backed up here on this tree. Right there's two coons are sitting. We just got the dogs down here on the main creek, letting them get a drink of water. I think the set headed back to the truck. There ain't no more dogs up there. I think we're gonna send them on out this creek here. So. Yeah. That'll cool them down, won't it? Yeah. May just struck in there at 240 yards. Sounds like Cam's giving a few little barks in there too. We might ease up this creek a little bit, Justin. And Try to hear him a little bit better. Why don't y'all look how pretty this is down here. Definitely God's country, ain't it, Justin? Yes, it is. Let's ease up here and see if we can hear. Y'all might be able to hear if she dropped back down. She's getting up a little higher up on the face around this hill right here. But I guess she dropped back down. Let's get a little closer. As we was walking in here, May treed was 214 yards when she treed. We're 204 right now. You might be able to hear. She was clicking them off. Let's get in here and see another coon. Uh, you tree you another one? You tree you another one? What do you think about that old thermal, brother? Man, that right there. Ain't that the berries? That's the berries. As old Mark Ratliff would say, that's the berries. That's the berries right there. Show you the coon here. I don't know if we'd have found it without the thermal. Might have got lucky. Right there's our coon. Well, I almost feel like we haven't got much recorded for you guys. It's just now 10 o'clock. We've treed and seen two coons. Already that first one was a double. I'm pretty sure that this one was a double. Going out of there, I've seen a, another set of eyes up above it looking down at me. We're gonna get these dogs loaded up in the truck and 
Maybe go tree us another cone. You ready, bud? I'm ready. Just now 10 o'clock and they are looking good. Third drop of the night. Come out of that can, man. Come out of that can, man. Coon dog's supposed to take off. May struck in there at 200 yards, and Cam, he's giving him a few barks in there. Sounding pretty hot there. There's a bark indicator. I'm good, don't they, buddy? Yeah, I do. I'd like to hear Cam open up a little more. It's really clicking them off in there. There's three trees. It is. Let's see. Almost 1045. Just got the thermal out and found the coon. Can't really get in here to see May. She's right in this big bush. <laughs> Coon's looking down. Let me put this thermal up, and I'll let y'all see it. Dustin got his laser from the Bright Eyes Fusion. Fusion Micro on the coon. There's its eyes. Or one eye. Get on there, Cam. Get on there, Cam. Good girl, May. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Got down here recording May a little bit and seen the coon's whole body. I just showed you its eye. There's its whole body. Got the laser on it. You just seen her. We're going to get out of this mess. Well, we just got back from that last tree with May and Cam. It is right at 11 o'clock. We've treed three coons, seen every one of them by 11 o'clock. We couldn't ask for no better of a night. I mean, the coons are really moving really well. We've got about an hour and 20 minute ride home, just about like we always do. Where we live at, copperheads and ticks and things are so bad. And as soon as the first frost hits, we hunt around there a little bit. But uh, you got anything to say, brother? Nope, had a good time. Glad you came back out and seen these Kentucky Cooner hounds and put yeah. them on the wood. Yeah. Well, y'all, thanks for watching Kentucky Cooner where there's a little less talk and a lot more action. For all your hunting supply needs, go on over and visit KentuckyCoonerHuntingSupply.com. Until next time, put them on the wood.